And welcome back to another episode of Science with Mike. Today's science subject, nature. What is nature, some people might think? The dictionary describes nature as things you can touch. But it's a lot more than that. For example, flowers are nature. Trees are nature. You can touch both of those. The sky is nature. And flowers again. And even signs are nature. They grow right up from the ground. Look. So basically, nature encompasses pretty much, pretty much all of science. Might as well just call this show the Nature with Mike show. Put a little flower in the O. The funny thing about nature is that there's just so much of it. In fact, there are so many trees in the world, we humans have a responsibility to continually cut them down so their population does not overgrow and overpower us. That's a true fact. You know, sometimes when I think about nature, I just, I... What is this? Oh no! Someone lost a dog! named Dutch. This, this particular case strikes deep within the very heart of my soul, because when I was a young boy, I had a dog who mysteriously died one day. <laughs> mysteriously. I can't do a science experiment when I know there's a missing dog in town. Well, that's it. We're calling off the experiment. We're calling off the nature experiment, we are gonna find this dog. I began the search for Dutch. I decided that I would be the one to return this dog to its family. I looked everywhere. I thought I might be able to get some help from the locals. Has anybody seen Dutch? Any of you? Have any of you seen a dog? His name is Dutch. Please! I was never gonna give up. Not this time. Not for Dutch. Oh, Dutch! Where are you, boy? Dutch? Dutch? Come home! Come home, boy! Come home! Where did you go? Where did you go, Dutch? Oh! He's gotta be around here somewhere. I'm gonna find him any second now. You'll see. I'm gonna find him and he's gonna be okay. He's gonna be okay.